Welcome to my channel. My name is Sasha. I was an escort in the industry for over 10 years. And today we're gonna to be talking about GFE, BBJ, finesse. How to finesse these tricks when they talking about BBJ, GFE, and all that bullshit, okay? I'm gonna keep it real with y'all. I made money from being straight up and being an honest escort, but some of my biggest bags really came from running game. Um, I checked a lot of money off of finesse and being dishonest and playing games with these motherfuckers in real life. Let me also say, regular people are watching hoes, tricks, and all this shit is watching, right? But the police is also watching. So all them comments in my in my comment section, like, oh, you know, teach me how to be an escort. Uh, I'm trying to get in the game. This is not the channel where I'm teaching girls how to become escorts or luring people and making prostitution look enticing where I'm going to teach you how to start prostituting. This is not the channel for that. If you are not already in the game, I recommend that you don't get in the game. The game is not something that you want to get into. It's not a lifestyle that I'm promoting. And to my subscribers and other people that's watching and stuff, with the people that's in the comment section asking how to get started escorting and stuff, stop replying to these people uh, telling them how to get started in prostitution because that is illegal and we don't do that on this channel. Without further ado, let's get into the video. Rule number one, you gotta know how to read a trick. You gotta know who gonna go for it and who not. If you are not a person that know how to read these tricks, then I do not recommend any of the tactics that I'm about to give. I will go to a hick town, a place where like white corny motherfuckers is, they got money and they don't want problems. I will go to a place that's not flooded with escorts and shit so that the game is not played out. Hey, hit the like button. If you have not hit the like button, hit the like button right now. When the calls start coming in, you're gonna get calls where people want regular service and you're also gonna get calls where people want BBJ, AKA a bareback blowjob, BBFS, AKA bareback full service, GFE, kissing in the mouth and all these sorts of things. Now these are the calls that like most escorts, they will hang up and they will be like, I don't do that and be done with it. These are the calls that if I get the call, depending on how they sound and if I can get them off the phone quick enough with no agreement, I will go ahead and finesse this call. And so here go your example. Hi, is this Sasha? Yes, this is Sasha. I was wondering if you are available. Yes, I'm available. Okay, what are your rates? And if I may ask, do you offer BBJ? My rates are woody woo. Um, and I'd rather not discuss service over the phone. Okay. But I will be more than happy to see you if you understand what I'm saying. Oh yeah, sure. Okay, so um, I'll text you the address and you can just let me know when you're here. Okay, um, I'm in the area. I think I could be there around 10 minutes. Okay, see you soon, sweetie. I'll send you the address. Hi, I'm here. I just arrived in the parking lot. Uh, what room are you in? Okay, sweetie, uh, I'm in room woo 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 or on floor woo 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 i'll meet you okay boom he come up i'm reading him soon as i see him is he nervous does he have on a wedding ring is he a goofy you know what i'm saying because you you gotta know how to read these motherfuckers is he a goofy is he gonna go for this shit is he scary is he scared period so all that determines like if i'm gonna go through with it or if I'm gonna say no thanks after I read them. Okay, so boom, he come in or whatever, you know, he set the donation down. After he set the donation down, I proceed to get on the phone. I get on the phone. Yeah, I'm okay. Yeah, he's here. Everything's fine. I'll be downstairs when I'm done. Hang up. Boom. Tell him. Yeah, um, I got people making sure that I'm okay, that I'm safe, that don't nothing happen to me. Okay, you know, you can go ahead and you can get comfortable. He proceeds to take his shoes off or whatever, you know, get naked, a little bit of small talk, boom, he's naked. I go ahead and I grab a condom. He, 
wait a minute, like I thought we agreed on doing a, a BBJ. Yeah, a blowjob, right? No, I meant uncovered. Oh no, honey, I don't do anything uncovered. Um, I work for an agency that is very strict on like no refunds. I'm sorry for the inconvenience, but I don't do anything uncovered. Whole time, making sure the donation is in my reach. I'm close enough to the door with my phone in my hand, my whole energy speaking. You know, I don't want this to have to be a problem, but it can be a problem if you want it to be a problem. He either gone go for the regular session or proceed to get dressed and get the fuck up out of there, period. So this is how I would finesse the bareback BBJ GFE kissing in the mouth ass calls. You know, this is how I would finesse this shit. Hit the like button right now. And like I said, I wouldn't recommend these tactics to girls that don't know what they're doing. If you don't know how to read a trick and you are not faster than the trick and you don't know how to play this shit, do not do this shit. I want to address another situation. If you have made it this far in the video, put the ear emoji down below. Don't make a comment on what I'm getting ready to say in my comment section because most people don't even make it this far. And I wanted to say this part for the people that really fuck with me. I wanted to say this part for y'all. The last video that I uploaded about the penises and the racial differences and stuff like that, that was actually a highly requested video um, from some of my biggest supporters, which are, you know, these tricks and these men that want to listen to me talk about sex and sexual things and view me in a sexual manner, you know. Um, that's really not the content or a video that, like, I would have put out um, on my page, you know. But understand that even though I'm not a prostitute anymore, I'm still hoeing. I'm still hoeing. And... These motherfuckers wanted to hear me talk about what size penis I like and if anybody ever pleased me and all this kind of stuff. So I went ahead and did it for them so I can get their views and they time and they likes because guess what? I'm hustling. I'm trying to get through the motherfucking dough. I know motherfuckers was probably like, what the fuck is Sasha on? Like she on here talking about penis and how she was, you know what I'm saying? Happy to sleep with a celebrity trick and blah, blah, blah. Listen, I'm doing my motherfucking job. You feel me? Drop an ear emoji down below if you made it this far and you hearing what I'm saying. And from here on, if y'all see me on here kind of like doing some weird shit or whatever, just look past it. Look past it, you know what I'm saying? And stay fucking with me because it's certain kind of content that they request. And you know, they wanna hear me talk about sex and what I like about sex and this and that. So baby, I'm just doing my motherfucking job. You feel me? And that's that on that. I fuck with y'all, period.